What's up, everybody? Welcome back. Welcome back. Happy 4th of July. Hope you guys enjoyed your weekend. Uh, today, I got to get myself right. Well, this weekend, I had to get myself right. And to start that off, I went ahead and started about the mid-temple area and went all the way around on both sides evenly with the Andy Slimline Pros. I don't have these zero gaps so as you see I'm cutting that's exactly how they come out the box and it's not bad not bad at all it cuts right through the hair right through the bulk doesn't get caught or nick my hair or skin at all so I definitely recommend these if you guys are looking for some nice trimmers. Now to smooth everything out, I'm going to use my Bronze Series 9 as always and get it all nice and shaved underneath, nice and smooth. And I like to use this mirror as you guys see. I really need to get a three piece mirror so I don't have to hold this in my hand when I'm doing these little tutorials but soon, soon you guys all definitely upgrade. Since I did do skin on the side, I will start with this next guideline with the lever about halfway closed. That way it'll be easier to blend out. Now with the lever fully closed, I'm going to go ahead and try and remove that line on the bottom. If I'm not able to remove the line completely with these clippers, I'll go ahead and just use my trimmers next, if necessary. This is the number one guard, so I'm just going right above that guideline I did previously. Not going up high at all, as you guys can see right there as I turn my head. Right after that, I'm going to get the half guard and close the lever all the way closed and just start blending that line out. And if it doesn't fully remove with the half guard, just go ahead and use no guard, close the lever just a little bit if necessary, and get to blending out that line. It honestly just depends how dark the area of the hair is that I need to blend that determines how much I need to close the lever. The side that I part my hair on I had a lot of bulk so with the number one guard I went ahead and did some clipper over comb work going side to side up and down with the, the cutting technique just trying to really get that bulk down so it blended in with the side. As you guys can see right here I have a very simple setup tripod two ring lights and my phone very simple you guys I believe this is the number two or three guard pretty sure it's the number three guard uh, I just went ahead and cleared up some extra bulk that I couldn't get with the clipper over comb technique and now I'm just down fading you guys with the one and a half guard the one guard now and just gonna work my way down I am on the opposite end now, I'm gonna do the same exact process that I did previously. I do apologize, terrible angles on this, I, that's my bad. I should have angled the camera a little better and just pretty much got a better angle on this. I didn't mean for you guys not to be able to see it, but just stay patient and I'll just skip through this as quick as possible. With my Andy Slimline Pros, I'm just going to go ahead and clean up all these baby hairs underneath, lining myself up, just starting from the middle and working my way out. I did put the shave gel on and very gently while applying no pressure, just going to stretch the skin and line myself up. This makes the cut look a lot fresher, a lot crisper, and it just allows the cut to last longer, so it just looks a lot fresher for a longer period of time. Just doing some cleanup work now, cleaning uh, this both of the sides up, and that'll go ahead and wrap up the cut, you guys. This was a very quick video. I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the beginning of the cut like always, and the next slides will be a couple of after videos I took. Hope you guys liked it, and a couple pictures. You guys have a good rest of your weekend, and stay litty.